everyone, welcome to QT News. We have a special segment today. Studio Global School had held a student election in their very own premises. What's special about it is that they built their very own voting machine. We have a reporter, Varsha, to give us the details. Yes, Joanna, it was quite an exciting day today. The students were very enthusiastic about the whole event. The highlight was that for the first time in their history, students built their very own voting machines with the help of Cutie Pie Kids. Here are some visuals of the whole event. Here comes the principal to cast her votes and to show her support to the students. to cast their votes for the first time on a voting machine. Even the school teachers played a part in their elections by participating and casting their votes. We have the nominees coming in and campaigning. They have some interesting developments and changes proposed by them. I feel like I went because uh, there is my friend who is my opponent and since her symbol is a water bottle, I don't think so it's that strong to win. And as my symbol is an eagle, eagle is a symbol of confidence and uh, uh, intelligent work. Hi, my name is Mohit from I'm Anita, a grade 7 pick, and I have been nominated for Greenhouse Vice Captain. And my symbol is Close Fist. It represents unity and good power, which are very important for a person to win any competition or live in the society. I took the symbol because I believe that where there is unity, there is always victory. So if I become the Vice Captain of Greenhouse, I will mainly focus on two objectives. Firstly, I will boost up the willpower of my team members. Secondly, I will improve the unity strategies of my house. The students show their excitement as first-time voters and talk about the importance of voting for the right candidate. There it was. I was feeling like I am going to a real election but very fun. It was very nice. I feel like I can press buttons all day long. Voting is very important for choosing a leader. So I felt this voting is very good because it's like real voting. Like EVM training and even our voting EVM music. So I felt that this is good. It was so exciting and while he was standing in the line and uh, it was a bit confusing that how is it but when the first chance we got after that it was a bit easy and it was First time uh, we were doing that, till now we have only studied about it in our books and we used to only vote on papers. This was so nice for me. We have the results and the winner announcement coming up. The students are waiting with a lot of anticipation. And finally, the results were announced. The winners are very happy and they are sharing their thoughts.
is also saved paper uh, from our school and also developed skills which was realistic and enjoyable. We have the principal and teachers coming in and sharing their final thoughts about the whole event. Today morning it was a coincidence and it was a fortunate experience which I had that I have attended students conducting an activity in, collect, in conducting the election polling happen and how well children understood the utility of it, how it was substituting the manual effort and what was the outcome of it they were able to easily identify. Usually we do it uh, manually by preparing the ballot boxes and the students using the ballot papers and then uh, writing down and then putting it to the ballot boxes. But this time it was a live project by the students, prepared by the students specially. And uh, the artificial intelligence being on the board, it was really exciting for us. Uh, it was like thrilling for all the students to vote through this machine. And uh, I think all the students enjoyed and this uh, they have all even passed on a message of uh, less uses of paper. Overall, it was one fun and exciting day that the students will always remember. This is Varsha reporting for QT News. Thank you Varsha for the details. It was great having you in our segment. That's it for today. This is Joanna signing off.